welcome to our house and to my house right here on the Bo Carver Show, right here on 620 AM KEXB, and we're here every Saturday morning from 7 AM to 8 AM Central Standard Time. Is it Saturday again? Yeah, can you? Yeah, I know. That's what my dogs say. When we get Saturday up at four last week in the morning. Which dog? One yeah, there's 10? all 20 of them. Yeah. They all go, it's Saturday. <laughs> <all right." laughs> but uh, we're here every Saturday morning, 7 a.m. to 8 a.m. Central Standard Time, and you can listen to us in the DFW area, and it covers a wide range of the 620 a.m. KXB. Uh, so listen to us on your radio. So hop in your truck or your car and turn on AM radio while you're in your jammies having coffee. Or but driving you, your kids to a sporting that's event. That's true. But if you're not doing that, then you, your can, mocha coffee. then you can go to your computer and then just search uh, www.620amkexb.com and then click the Listen Live button. K-E-X-B. Oh, listen to that. I'm 620. Go- uh, the experts K-E-X-B. in monkey, monkey business. business. Or you can go to uh, you get, get a free app on your phone. K-E-X-B. It's called iHeartRadio and then search 620AMKXB and you can listen to us from anywhere in the world. And we do have listeners world. from in everywhere. The world. That's the Very universe. wide listens. Y'all scared yet? Yes. yes. I live in the world. <laughs> I was scared Robert a second ago. You almost had a, you almost had a monkey sure avalanche world, a second ago. I live, I live in my own world. It's the only way to be You do. Sometimes you do. <laughs> no, there's no question about that. Speaking now, of my own world, can I have my book back? This morning... I am so excited to have this special guest. We took a tour of their uh, facilities about two weeks ago, and I can't tell you how impressed we were of this particular item, this weapon that's manufactured down there. Please make welcome President of Bond Arms Incorporated, Garden Bond. Good morning, brother. Good morning. We how literally you guys drooled during this tour. We had to have a jewel rag. <laughs> what a Don't pleasure. You. JT's been playing with all the toys that you oh. brought. Man, he hasn't are stopped incredible. yet. These are incredible. He brought a whole briefcase full of mm-hmm. different uh, firearms, and uh, they're just pretty cool. They really are. So, Garden. Now, oh, but you, wait, they're not loaded, and there are no bullets. The gun is always loaded. Yeah, so, you're from Granbury. Yes. And tell us a little bit how uh, Bond Arms got started. Well, we grew up in a small town, uh, Flood Ada, down in West Texas, close to Lubbock. And our after uh, school activity was uh, shooting guns. And, you know, we, we grew up in the age of uh, just about every pickup truck in the uh, school parking lot. Correct. Had a, a 22 <laughs> and a shotgun. Yeah. Good way to get the SWAT team and, out today. Yeah. yeah. And, yeah. and, you know, and back then we didn't even lock the cars, you know, so right. it was uh, you had a whole different age than a what it is day. now. That was the a better day, days. really. Absolutely. Well, my, uh, my, my brother uh, actually engineered and designed this about 23 years ago. And, you know, I like guns, but boy, he is totally ate up with guns. He was a lot of that. <laughs> and the Derringer uh, probably had the worst reputation of any gun out there of being a cheap, dangerous, throwaway gun. And he, he always told me, you know, he said, you know, I, I would never buy a Derringer. And so he sat down and, you know, it's, it's a long story, but the, the short of it is he sat down and designed a better mousetrap. <laughs> and one of the... So you just shoot mouse <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's, all it can, that's all it can shoot <laughs> and what, what you know the, um, the the guns of the past actually derringers uh, i have one in my drawer i should have brought it this morning but it's a uh, patented 1856 uh, remington design it's serial number 391 and so derringers have uh, literally been in continuous production by somebody for over 160 years wow and so for the last 23 years we have built the um, Cadillac or Rolls or Rolls Royce of, of of the Derringer, and they're stylish too, more stylish than the Derringer. Oh, absolutely! This has got a flag on it. Yep, absolutely. This is a brand new model, and we're getting all sorts of uh, great feedback on this and thing. This one shoots uh, well. It's an interchangeable barrel. Yep, and it shoots shotguns and uh, uh, fourteen shoot shotguns. Yeah. <laughs> shotgun you have to aim it at a shotgun. Yeah, and it will. <laughs> go ahead yeah, and laugh. I knew exactly what he meant. There you go. Now. The some of the features that he put on this gun that the original Derringer we we don't even call it a Derringer anymore because it's bigger it's more substantial that's one thing JT just said is that this thing's right. substantial oh, yeah. right and uh, the the first thing he did was you know a gun that's been around this long he was the first one to ever put a trigger guard on this type of gun you know what a thought you know <laughs> you know all these other guns have that why did, why didn't this style have it yeah because he wanted you to shoot yourself and does he brag to you about exactly. that all the time Shoot. Or he no, like, 
together, yeah. Yeah. Get it together yeah, at family luncheons brothers. or dinners or you know family <laughs> gatherings. Hey, garden man, look what I did. <laughs> no, actually, he's the original Bond, so he talks like this. Hey, Gordon, look what I did. Yeah, he, he has the British he got, accent. So. Yeah, from, yeah. The, from the, the Majesty, <laughs> Majesty the, the Queen. The the other thing that he did was the locking lever on the regular Derringer was a lever that you actually had to flip 180 degrees to unlock the barrel, load it, close it, and, and flip it back. He made it very easy to operate just by pushing a, a spring-loaded lever about a quarter of an inch, and the barrel will flip up and locks down. And it's the it, 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 to guys when we show that it shows it, it's like a, a a moth to the light because it's like the Zippo lighters of the past. Oh yeah, and and it's just like when you do that, it's just like wow, that is so cool. The Everybody maybe I should make that one that it, just now. Oh, yeah. Maybe I should make one like that that is a lighter. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. The but, the other thing that he did was that um, you know we when we grew up we didn't have a whole lot of money, so he he wanted to make a gun that a guy could buy the gun, the base gun, and he could interchange barrels. And so uh, we've got over 40 different interchangeable barrels now. And I just showed you guys a few minutes ago where we took a a six-inch barrel and put a a two-and-a-half-inch barrel in less than 20 seconds. Yeah, It takes maybe about five I didn't, I didn't time him, but it was fast he, he enough. He wasn't counting. Yeah. Well, I know one thing. We purchased a Snake Slayer model of that awesome Bond Arms weapon. And you know, you say yeah. Snake Slayer. If you really, t- that is a farm weapon too. I mean, oh, yeah, that is a protective weapon. That's a farm weapon. That is an all around everything. You know, <laughs> shoot a shot. <laughs> well, the one we have, the Snake Slayer, and the one we purchased. Uh, came with the uh, 410, where you could shoot a 410 buckshot. Up to a 3-inch 410. Up to a 3-inch 410, wow. correct. And a long Colt 45. Kind Out of, of that hand three and a half inch barrel, I believe is what originally comes with the snake yeah. slayer. Is that right? Yes. And uh, is it that that weapon is incredible? I mean, the recoil on it is actually less than my. Oh, take out the trash. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's, it's so sweet, and the and the fact that we you know inter, can interchange barrels. In fact, we're we get we're getting one from you today, a two and a half oh, inch nine dog. millimeter, <laughs> and all these are double Plural. barrels. So tell us the different uh, double barrel combinations they can get uh, out from size to also sure. the, the we, cal- caliber. We actually have uh, five different barrel lengths, uh, two and a half inch, three inch, three and a half, four and a quarter. And just just within the last couple of months, the six inch barrel, which wow. people have been begging us for. And it's an amazing gun. And. And, and for JT, you know, we, we even have uh, California legal versions. There you go. Got to know that. One, one of the, uh, I'll just tell you this, and, and JT, don't hit me. But the, uh, <laughs> <He's got it. laughs> we, we have show guns, and show guns are guns that we take to shows. And, and they're, oh, they, I've eaten there before. Uh, there you go. Oh. And, <laughs> that's a different show gun. <laughs> and, we, and we don't even have the uh, firing pin holes drilled in those. And those are actually truly California <laughs> compliant guns. Oh, no, hey no firing pins at all. No so. offense to me, man. They're crazy over there. <laughs> so of Straight up kooky double barrel. When you, uh, Does it shoot both uh, at the same time? Or, Wouldn't that be or cool? Yeah. <laughs> that Some was of the my, Derringers do. Judge, that, that was it, my first question, too, when I looked at that guy. Actually, because I'm looking at it thinking, well, how does that separate the barrels? Actually, there's an automatic selector in there. So each time that you cock the hammer back, it, it does it automatically. It moves the hammer head up and down. I'll be done. And, and you can know about Judge, you're the never pen. supposed to look down the barrel of a gun you like that. You can see that. A pen. Hey, the judge can. The right. judge can look down the barrel. He can do whatever he wants. Hey, uh, I got a question for you. Do you have one that has I mean, did you hear that? calibers here? Like a 410 and a 45? Oh, you can do either or. Yes. No, I mean, I mean, I'm sorry, not, not 14, 45, but uh, you have different calibers too, like a 38, 9 millimeter. Uh, they won't be you know, like uh, the this one, which is the Mama Bear, and that's a two and a half inch barrel. That'll do a 38 or 357. One minute, one minute. And so, but yeah, and with one of the biggest features that he put on the gun that was really a game changer for this style of gun was the rebounding and locking hammer. And you notice that it's in a half cock position. Mm-hmm. And so all the guns before, uh, the hammer would lay right on the firing right, pins. Right, right. And if you dropped Safety it with issue. live rounds, it could go off. It failed the drop test. So he figured out <laughs> how to make it jump back and lock and patented it. Nice. Good. And so it just made 
made a outstanding. It, That's amazing. Here we go That's with the family idea. gatherings again. There Gordon, go. I did that. I did that. Thirty. I've had that idea uh, for many years. Bondarms.com. Bondarms.com. Oh, you got to go check amazing. that out after the show. Don't do it right now. We're gonna go have to take a short show. break. So yes, y'all check it out. Uh, Bondarms.com. Gordon, that's wonderful. And we're going to come back with more Garden Bond and JT King with The Day in History. Don't go away, guys. Come on. 